one of ten Spitfires that attacked 24 109s protecting a force of Heinkel bombers. He closed to within 50 yards of one of the agile, single-engine German fighters, firing into its fuselage from tail to cockpit. It rolled onto its back, issuing white smoke, and started to nose down. But fire from other aircraft forced Lorry to pull away, so he never saw it crash. They that have climbed the white mists of morning, they that have soared before the world's awake to herald up their foemen to them scorning. The thin dawn's rest their weary folk might take. Some that have left other mouths to tell the story of high blue battle, white young limbs that bled. How they thundered up the clouds to glory, or fallen to an English field stained red. Oh, I have slipped the surly bonds of earth, and danced the skies on the laughter silvered wings. Sunward I've climbed and joined the tumbling. Protected close below 
the gratitude of every home in our island, in our empire, and indeed throughout the world, except in the abodes of the guilty, goes out to the British airmen, who, undaunted by odds, unwearied in their constant challenge and mortal danger, are turning the tide of the world war by their prowess and by their devotion. Never in the field of human conflict was so much owed by so many to so few.